And it's gonna be hard to do. It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. Because what happens is you. Friday, friends. How are we doing today? What is going on? Ooh. <laughs> I hope that wasn't too loud. That hurt. <laughs> uh, what's up, guys? What is going on? Hello, hello, hello. Hi, Allie. Hero of time. Parade of laughter. Meryl Streep. Sammy. Wait, wait, wait. Ooh. That one was loud. What's up, guac? Quack. I... I'm awake. It's three o'clock. I'm awake. I swear to God. Telephone booth. What's going on? Hi, anime hero. Celeste Knight. Thank you for the 11 month resub. What's up, Toted Isle? Hi, Bree. Time Sorcerer. Uh, Water Sprite, you got your vaccine today. That is awesome. Very exciting. I know you are in like the medical field, right? So that is awesome. What's up, Tootie? Hi, Joxy. Ivana, what's going on? So last night, you may recall, <laughs> if you were hanging out, Josh door dashed a bunch of cases of LaCroix. So today we have some ice cold passion fruit LaCroix to quench our thirst. I'm feeling good about it. <laughs> uh, Lucia, what's going on? How you doing? Hi there, Howling Alchemist. I have a Zozo hanging with me. Oh. You know, she was laying in the bed, curled up in my little pillow with Josh. But she loves me. She's decided that she loves me. She left just to come down here and lay on the floor so that she could be near me. <laughs> That's what I tell myself anyway. <laughs> That's what I tell myself. You took down your Christmas decorations, Time Sorcerer. I'm thinking about doing that. I think that if I like started putting away Christmas stuff, as sad as that sounds, uh, you know, it would just, it would get me in like the cleaning mood, you know? And that needs to be done. Big time. Big time, big time. Hey there, Aspie Paws. My day's been all right. I did some dishes this morning and cooked myself a lovely lunch of some zoodles and some tomatoes and i had these corn brand meatless meatballs and i had never tried them before so uh it was my first time trying them they're very yummy very very yummy i'm <clears throat> setting up psvr on ps5 is a pain is it i didn't even think about that we could set up our psvr in the living room where the ps5 is any baby news i'm 20 weeks today we're halfway I guess, <laughs> which is really terrifying sounding. I know that we've got plenty of time to do what needs to get done, but when you when I say it out loud, I'm like, whoa, <laughs> whoa. <clears throat> Stuck on a couch with some weird stomach pain. Feel better. I'm sorry to hear that. <sighs> Had a really nice cube organizer for my entertainment center. And have to try and dust it at least once or twice a month. Yeah, we have like a black with glass um, like entertainment thing for our big TV downstairs. Um, and those are the two worst combinations for dust. Black furniture or glass furniture. And I truly am not. I'm so bad. I feel you on that. I never dust it. <laughs> hey there, stars and shine. Do I use TikTok? I do. I mean, I don't post TikToks but I watch TikToks, <laughs> so. And a way for a free adapter for the PS camera. Ah, lack of USB ports. No breaking news today. So yesterday we booted up our second island for the first time in like five months because my villagers were like, oh my God, I haven't seen you in five months. And we tore down a bunch of stuff we're probably going to continue tearing stuff down today, to some extent. 
Oh, I caught another tarantula last night. They were out like crazy last night. Yes, yes. Hi, Chew! Wow, both my dogs love me today. Who the fuck? Come here, bud. You see him? Not really. He's always so good about making sure he's just out of frame. Oh my god, he's trying to sniff my peach on my desk. You like it? It smells good, don't it, buddy? It smells like... Pe oh, you're, you're being blocked there, too. <laughs> it smells good! It smells like peach! <laughs> oh, good boy. Oh, now you're cute. Now you're cute. Wow, both my dogs love me. I can't believe it. Oh, thank you. Thank you so much. You got your fourth duck. You got Mallory after eight tickets. Nice. This is my wolf island. I have nine wolves, but I have Wolfgang's amiibo card. So I'm going to have all ten wolves. Or all ten villagers will be wolves, I should say. But I have to find my amiibo cards. Um, because I haven't. <laughs> because I don't know where they are right now. But I'll find them. Now that is a good pair of dogs. And also, my boots are still on the floor. <laughs> oy, oy, oy. Whatever, Chewy. Candy skull mask. Whoa, I don't think I have this at all anywhere. Well, does from Gulliver. I don't have that one yet. Water Sprite, thank you for the 46 month resub. It's been a weird lifetime. <laughs> but you're gonna make it a little bit brighter. That's way too nice. Way too nice. Um, I appreciate the resub. I, I hope that, hang on, let me click on this TikTok link before I lose it. I hope that uh, things are well. But uh, thank you so much. Sorry, hold on guys, I'm having problems. Everything's falling apart. Okay. Whew. Move all the VR games to the console storage because you have to sacrifice a USB in the back to have both the camera and the VR itself plugged in. Good to know. Good to know. Vector, thank you so much for the eight month resub. Oops. How are you today? Um, yeah, it has been a weird lifetime, you're right. <laughs> Ooh, okay, so I moved uh, Able Sisters just so that I could do some terraforming. You'll see that I've started building some things. I kind of want- Ooh, Kix is here. I kind of want to enclose my... Uh... Plaza a little bit? But, you know, there was all this stuff in the way, so I'm gonna clear out this stuff today and try and... Figure out whatever the heck we're doing there. But I mostly was trying to just figure out, like, what I want as far as this entrance goes leading up to the plaza. So we'll probably work on that today. See what we can do. Oh, look at this girl chilling with her soup. What a cute outfit. Oh, my goodness. Dean Arceo, thank you so much for the four-month resub. Um, everything's falling apart. Is someone talking about my life? <laughs> just the world. No, I, uh, I appreciate the reason. How are you doing today? No one has flexed with their channel points yet, no. I know some people are saving them up, though. They're trying. Hey there, bunny kisses. Oh, you know, I probably have uh, some... some stars on the beach. 13 days and then I feel like I can finally breathe again. Not to like start the day by <laughs> talking about all of this chaos, but I do have to admit I'm mildly concerned about January 20th and the potential for more chaos. I'll just leave it at that. You know what I mean? Makes me slightly nervous. Why flex when you you can also make you dab four times. 40 times? Is that how many dabs you could do? 
for the cost of a flex. Oh, this is where the that ramp was yesterday, so I can can knock those down as well. Oh my god, <laughs> forty dabs! Please don't, I beg of you. What's up, Emmett? How you doing? Hey, Stardust Spark. Wow, that's impressive though, Art Master. That's like halfway. Yeah, <laughs> we'll need a dab cooldown. What's up, Bobby? Make the stream limit 39 a day. How's everyone's Fridays been? I will not be streaming super long today because I'm a slow dummy and I didn't start until like three o'clock, three o'clock practically. And uh, I got to watch some drag race tonight. Sammy and Allie and Ashley and I have been, have been, <laughs> we watched the one episode so far, but we watch them together on Discord and it's lovely. And I very much am looking forward to it. So. That's at seven o'clock. And I guess at some point I should figure out food between now and then. <laughs> we'll see. <laughs> Damn. I, I guess I didn't wish on that many stars, but geez Louise. Also, I'm gonna like flatten this entire section where the froggy races were. My doctor says I can't dab. Sorry, guys. <laughs> My doctor says no more than one dab a day. <laughs> Do I ever visit Subscriber Islands? Yeah, honestly, we did it somewhat recently, but I used to do it a lot more often. I'd love to get more in the habit of doing it again. Kyle, oh my God. Last night when I was playing off stream, Guess what Kyle did? He asked to move. Are you surprised? Only the 80th time in the history of my Animal Crossing life. Can you believe this little sucker? <sighs> Offensive, really. Also, I really do like the vibe we have going on with our wolf neighborhood. But if we potentially move everybody around, I was thinking about trying to make it feel like a little, I don't want to say city, but just like a little lived in area, M more city. I'll get like pattern uh, paths and stuff like that. Patterns for paths. And then the rest of the island would be a lot more like natural feeling. That's kind of what I was thinking last night. A dab a day keeps the doctor at bay. <laughs> I need to start dabbing more then. <laughs> oh my god. Keith! Thank you so much for the prime sub. Enjoy the emotes. I appreciate you hanging out with us. Like a downtown area maybe, yeah. Uh... I want to like peruse the the kiosk for patterns today as well you just woke up pika p you're not home why did i think you were home oh he's sweeping his front step i'm so in love <laughs> look at how cute he is also his shirt is very appropriately winter you know Oh my god. Would you look at him? Would you just look at him? What a fella. What a fella. There we go. Grandpa's crafting. Once I start something, I gotta keep on going till it's done. Sounds like Josh. <laughs> Raccoon figure. Oh, I guess I know that one. Um, 
Is that a higher tier emote? Do we still have it? Oh, we do. That's a twall. She's one of the Senrio villagers. Not in New Horizons, unfortunately. Thanks, Keith. Elvar gave me the pirate bandana today and I screamed. I got the, um, one of the outfits in my other island today because Gullivar was there. <laughs> Look at these two. That's a real dirty street, huh? Oh my goodness. Thank God we've got these two around to clean them up. Cleaning up the streets. Too good. Too good. But yeah, that's all I did yesterday was like that bit of terraforming you saw by the plaza, so... I kind of want to, like I said, tear all this stuff down. And, uh... Keep working on it. Competitive meatness. Apparently. <laughs> What's up, power cart? Oh yeah, this is where I moved Able Sisters to. I have no idea if it's going to be permanent or not. I just needed it out of my way. So, I have a feeling I'm going to be spending a lot of money moving things around in this island. Hi, Allie. Allie. Don't say that. To be honest, I think I'm going to start tearing this whole area down. I also am not really sure what I want to do with my rivers. Because if you look at my map right now, we have very straight, not natural looking water because I was trying to take up as little uh, space as possible so that we could do all of our like mini games and stuff. So I'm thinking I won't do this today, but I'm thinking I'm going to literally like get rid of all of those and just start all the water fresh, you know what I mean? I feel like that's the play at this point. Uh, yeah, I'll visit someday. We'll, we'll definitely do island visits again. Okay. We're tearing it down. Uh, Iwiana. Hello. <laughs> I just hope you're doing all right, Allie, you know? What's going on with this island now? I just want to decorate it. I want to like, I don't want to like tear down my main island and redo stuff over there, but we have all this potential, right? On, uh, on this island. So we're starting fresh, kind of. Your save file got corrupted. Like, you lost all your island stuff, or what? That's horrible. What happened? Running my way to terraforming now. What happened? I'll probably back up my island, huh? God, I have a second island. I mean, like, I neglected this island for so long. When I relaunched the game afterwards, I got a notification that said there was corrupted data on my save file. Like, you just left your Switch and it just... Nothing happened, it just corrupted? Dude, that's awful. I'm sorry. Oh, 
hoping for an Adventure Time themed island. That sounds fun. So, Josh is a loser <laughs> who completely abandoned Animal Crossing. But when the game came out, he claimed he was going to make a Bojack themed island. And of course he never did. His island is called Hollywood, but he never followed through and it breaks my heart. So maybe the day will come where I'll steal his switch <laughs> and I'll make Hollywood. At the option to delete the corrupted data or restart my island, I tried to delete just the corrupted data, but nothing was able to be recovered. I don't know what made it happen. That sucks. I'm like, that's terrifying, honestly, with how many hours I've put into Animal Crossing, you know? Hey, Joel. What if Shit's Creek Island? <laughs> oh my god. We could make the motel. Like, all the animal houses in a row could be the motel. It would be tough because I feel like most of their defining things are, like, the cafe. Well, the cafe we could probably make, like, outside or something. And, like, Rose Apothecary. And I'm like, hmm. You got me thinking. What do you- what villagers do you think would represent the characters in Schitt's Creek? <laughs> Played almost daily since launch too. That's heartbreaking, man. I'm so sorry that happened. I'll have the patience for terraforming. We're like kind of tearing down this entire island, which is something I've never done before, really. Um, so that'll be interesting. I guess the good news is that I didn't have a ton of stuff everywhere, which makes it a little easier. Bob's garage. <laughs> I guess like you could you could do like cute outdoor decorated areas to represent those buildings. And then if you there's there's definitely good uh villagers I think to represent them like a snooty villager or like Moira. I would almost say like a snooty villager for Alexis too. But like when we're talking like end game Alexis, you know? <laughs> She, I, she, I, I won't stand me still watching, but you know what I mean? <laughs> Would be tough. Uh, Cam, thank you for the sub. I appreciate it. Just got to switch and end this game and I'm loving it. Yay, Nikki love. I want everyone to join the Animal Crossing cult. Uh, Audie or Maddie for Alexis. I'm trying to think who would be a good David. Are there any like villager types for male villagers that are like sassy? You know? <gasps> Raymond. I almost feel like Dobie could be uh Johnny. He's not like old, old, but like, I don't know. I sort of get the vibe. Bob could just be Bob. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. Is me. Hmm. I should check my able sisters though. Curlos for the eyebrows. <laughs> I dig it. I dig it. Your Raymond needs to leave, Allie? How come? You don't love him anymore? Smug villagers would work. I feel on my island. He has that sassy vibe. I'm tired of looking at him. <laughs> I don't know why that's the best sentence ever. I'm just tired of looking at him. <laughs> Oh my god.
do, 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 do. Um, not really feeling a lot of stuff in the shop today. These ski goggles are fun. Like, it would be fun to make a little ski outfit, maybe. But I don't know if I want to right now. I wish there was, like, a white, pa white ski pants or something. Oh, I guess the pink works with that. I'll think about it. Void Raymond a power move. <laughs> oh my god. Like, I don't dislike Raymond, so don't get me wrong. I just... I, I just never hopped on the hype train, you know what I mean? I'm sure if I had him, I would not dislike him and I would, you know learn to enjoy his company and whatnot, but, uh, oh, I, I went in the shop and turned off my, my Raymond convert. Your homecoming hero, thank you so much for the 29 month resub. Working on some writing and blog stuff, stuff after waking up from an unintended two hour nap. It's going a solid day. <laughs> Perhaps later, boys. Need more white shoes. Never find the ones that work perfectly for outfits, yeah. I feel like I'm really boring and I wear the same shoes constantly. Um, oh, I gotta move those flowers. Okay. <laughs> Everybody's sweeping today. They know that it's cleanup week. <laughs> Always felt like most of the shoes look weird and too big. Some of the boots and stuff feel really big. Oops. No, I didn't mean to buy two. I think it just depends on the outfit I'm going for, but yeah, I'm really boring and stick to like some basic shoes a lot of the time, I think. I guess I'll find my fossils for the day. Since technically I... Oh, look, here's my snowball in the flower. Since technically I need um, fossils still, actually. I guess it's the anime fan in me. <laughs> it works sometimes. Oh, I needed to buy a new um, slingshot. Was the Terra Foreman. Well, uh, we just tore down a couple things, really. But I started trying to figure out, like, an entrance and plaza area last night, and I thought we could expand on that today. My god, I'm gonna spend like half the day digging up flowers, aren't I? We'll see. 
Listen, this is all stuff that has to get done at some point, right? So like, I might as well just dive in head first. Assess these, please. <laughs> so Josh and Ashley always and I always we're in like a group chat together and we always send each other updates on things regarding current events shall we say like the last thing I shared was that West Virginia I think it was West Virginia yeah some guy was like just elected some kind of um you know position in West Virginia and he was like at the <laughs> protests yesterday two days ago whatever day it was um but he got arrested <laughs> and so i shared that and it's just like our our conversation history is like all these links josh sending the video you about to lose your job that song that lady singing to the cop then josh just texted that the guy who was getting his photoshop and uh, photoshop his photo op in Pelosi's office, the mail theft guy, he got arrested. <laughs> you know, listen, again, it's like I was saying yesterday, we have to celebrate the small victories. I think that we're allowed to feel good about these things, even if it does, even if it changes nothing, it probably will change nothing. And that's the sad thing. However, it feels good right now, and I'm going to enjoy it. <laughs> oh god okay uh let me go sell some stuff shall, shall we <laughs> the attempted coup isn't it so infuriating that like every time you see an article about it they still talk about it like it's it was just a protest ugh I'm sorry. I'm sorry. We don't have to. We don't have to get into it. <laughs> Just hard to not have feelings right now. Okay. Oh, I don't actually need these. Not keeping the basketball shorts. Sorry. What's this headband? I'll keep the lawn chair. Oh my god, Judy. Oh my god, Allie. Oh, totally. It's... Ugh. Whatever. Who holds law enforcement accountable? These people are getting arrested that were part of this incident. Okay, that's great. But who is going to arrest the police who were complicit in all of it? No one? I don't understand. How's it work? <clears throat> I'm gonna keep my cherries in case I move a tree. I guess I'll put. Uh, I'll keep the fencing actually because I might decorate some areas as we terraform today. They <laughs> Yeah, it, it's, I don't know. It's very eye-opening. Oh, okay, that, that kind of headband. Um, I guess if anything, I'm glad that I'm learning what I need to be learning. You know what I mean? Like, um, honestly, really vibing with this wallpaper that I have in here. I might, this room needs a full, <laughs> 
<laughs> redo, obviously. But I might keep this green wall paper. I like it a lot. <laughs> um, ooh, that's kind of like a, I don't know if I've seen that color lawn chair before. So I have a, I have to remember that I have a lot of things I tore down. I have garden benches, log benches, log stools, all kinds of stuff. So if I'm looking for that later to decorate with, I don't have to make more. I have a billion Cosmos showers. <laughs> I, I don't think I'll need all of those. Oh, excuse me. I have no excuse. I got plenty of sleep. Oh, I had this one already. I have two of them. Huh. I'll have to change one to something different. Okay, yeah, we have like very little stuff stored in this game, honestly. Committing to buying a bidet attachment for my toilet. Honestly, I'm so happy for you. I swear to God, it's life-changing and I cannot believe it's not the norm. <laughs> not here anyway. I know it very much is in other places. We have uh, one on two of our toilets. And so <laughs> like the toilet downstairs here doesn't have a bidet attachment. And I'm starting to think we need to get one because I always just end up going upstairs. I can't tell if there are flowers here. There's not. Okay. <laughs> Outdoor shower area with all the Cosmos showers. Oh, let me look, Sammy. I haven't looked in a long time. Yeah, you can buy bidet attachments. Um, there's tons of brands. I wish I could tell you what brand we have here. We had a different one at the old house. I like them both. I like the one we have now a little bit better because it has like two different modes. It has like, it can spray towards the back or it can spray towards the front. <laughs> I'll find out <laughs> the brand. I'll figure it out. Um, but for real, like, why are we afraid to wash our butts? <laughs> there will never be an update like that, but I wish I could relocate my plaza. Not necessarily in this island since we're starting over, but I don't like where my plaza is on Peaberry. To uninstall? I, I honestly, so Josh installed them, so you'd have to ask him. We actually just left the one on our old toilet when we moved because we're like, it just felt strange to like unhook it and rehook it back up, <laughs> you know? And we just bought new ones here. But I, he claims they're super, super easy to install. So my guess would be that they are probably somewhat easy to uninstall as well. Aren't too hard to uninstall them multiple times with moving around. Oh, that's the beauty of it, Swan and Fox, truly. I'm like, wow, I was very wasteful before. <laughs> uh. Yeah, ours doesn't even have like a temperature attachment thing. You have to check your toilet too, because I think like it depends on if you even have the ability. If there's one that allows for warm water, it doesn't mean that your toilet necessarily is compatible for that. But I'll be honest, I thought that the cold water was going to be like a deal breaker for me. It's not. <laughs> Just saying.
Okay. Um, here's the deal. I'm actually going to get rid of a lot of these flowers. Only reached 120 in the mines for Stardew. Okay, I'm just not a big fan of the pansies in general, to be honest with you. I'm gonna get rid of these basic ones. I'll keep my resources because I don't know what they look like here and I may wanna craft stuff later. You want to know how to really elevate your bathroom experience? <laughs> Obviously, get a bidet attachment. Okay, that's step one. Step two, squatty potty. I can vouch. All right, let's see what my Nook Mile stuff looks like. <clears throat> oh, hey, you can get these new reactions. Duh, forgot to do that. <laughs> I'm just being honest. Literally elevate, <laughs> yeah, your feet elevate. Wow, I learned some new reactions. I should probably get all this stuff too. As you can tell, I did not give a lot of uh, love to this island. Um, Here we go, okay. I have this, can, can you see it? You can't even see this stuff that well, hold on. Let me, boop. I got the yellow lifeguard chair, red chair, red porta potty. I love this street lamp. I'm really glad because I've used it all over my island already. Almost looks brown. I bet it's supposed to be black, but doesn't that like wait till it turns around? Doesn't that look like reddish brown? White seats, the snack machine, the red horsey, green, black clock. Blue telephone box. Ooh, the pink cotton candy. Red and yellow gym. Blue turbine. Ooh, the white and blue lighthouse. I'm gonna use that. Uh, black Godzilla. White pool. The very colorful teacup ride. And I guess that's it. Um, I'm definitely going to use the lighthouse in this island. Uh, pretty like, pretty natural, Sammy. Pretty outdoorsy feeling. I know I sort of did it in New Leaf, but I kind of want that woodsy vibe for the wolves again. Although I was saying earlier, I kind of want to do like a little town area where the wolves live and get like cool street patterns and stuff. And then like everything else would be really like woodsy and stuff maybe. I don't know, that's that's my initial thought. I'm gonna, uh... There's like no way I have a lighthouse in my storage, but before I order another one, I guess I'll double check. Yeah, sort of, Chelsea. It'll very much be like whatever happens, happens, work in progress kind of island, I think. Okay. 
<laughs> yeah, there's like nothing in my storage. Good to know. Back we go. Wish we get get Nook and Isabel's winter clothes for ourselves, yeah. I I love Isabel's sweater so much. Can't you get that like yellow and orange sweater he's wearing or no? Maybe? Um, I guess I could... I have to check my fencing too, like I don't even know if I have all of the fencing in this one yet. Yeah, I've been kind of a weird way- weird week messes up the days, I feel like. the socks maybe are what I'm thinking of with that pattern yeah I wish I didn't have to like boot up the thing every time no nope. <laughs> definitely not <laughs> It's weird not having like a <laughs> hundred thousand nook miles. I'm like, wow, I'm actually gonna use a lot of my miles, aren't I? <laughs> Menuing quality of life is one of the reasons you haven't bothered to come back. There's definitely a lot of tedious menuing and whatnot. Half the reason everyone's game time is so high. <laughs> the odds of me actually changing my hair like at all are very low and yet I feel like I'm obligated to buy all of these, you know? I see, this totally makes sense. All the hours waiting for people to fly onto your island. <laughs> that too. Uh, I should... If I haven't already, I should add my, uh, this friend code. This Switch's friend code to the, like, sub thing in the Discord. So that you guys can help me. <laughs> when it comes to decorating and stuff down the line and I'm looking for items. Just like you spoil me already in my other game. Yeah, and all the time balloon farming. Okay. I see, this totally makes sense. Like that took longer than it needed to, you know? <laughs> Uh, now I can finally finish terraforming around the backside of the plaza. Really quickly, I know it's only been like not even an hour, but I have to take a really quick break. Go do my test. 
Um, but I'll be right back. Give me just a minute, guys. BRB. Hi. Thank you guys for waiting. Sorry. <laughs> you know, I need to go grocery shopping. There's a balloon. Hello, I'm back. All is good. Um, I was like, oh, I'll bring a snack down. Oh, didn't buy a new thing. We have like no food. I was like raiding the fridge and the pantry. 
Nothing. dark sitting at your desk yeah josh was napping go figure <laughs> he wasn't napping but he was like in bed he's like i'm tired again um but it was like pitch black in the room he's like oh i'm trying to get work done but i'm just sleepy and i was like well because you're laying in bed in the dark like <laughs> of course you're gonna be sleepy that balloon will have despawned right i think that a despawn, which is fine. I'm not concerned. Do, 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 do. Okay, let's... Get started by just building like a one, one thing around. That's actually two, but oh well. I always win at animal, animal Crossing. Wish I could take a nap. I mean, I'll allow it. <laughs> you have my permission. I don't know, whenever I take a nap though, I just... I almost every time I just feel worse when I wake up. Unless I'm like sick and I genuinely just need sleep, you know? Working from home in bed for the longest time because my old apartment didn't have a desk. It was the worst idea for someone who loves naps. Josh does it a lot, and like, I try not to like, I'm like, listen, you do you, like, do your thing, and I, but I just feel like that's making it worse for him, you know what I mean? I'm like, if you worked at your desk. <laughs> also, he always lays in the bed and works, and so if I'm in the bedroom trying to live my life, and I make any kind of sound, he's like, oh, I'm trying to work. And I'm like, well, I'm trying to live in my bedroom. <laughs> Go work in your work room. <laughs> Naps are like four plus hours, yeah. That like messes up my whole day if I sleep that long in the middle of the day. Hey, Lucky. How you doing today? Oh my god, the Gengar bed. The sleeping bag thing. It's not even a sleeping bag. It's a sleeping bag for your face. Okay, how do I want to do this, friends? I think I want it to get a little bit bigger in this corner again here. Definitely gonna have to move Nook's Cranny, but you know, for now it's chillin'. Cannot be horizontal if I want to get anything done, yeah. Yeah, when I like lay in bed and play video games, I get sleepy too. It's really hard to visualize this, I think, because of all the existing mess around it. But I'm hoping this is more or less moving in the direction I want it to be. I'm gonna get rid of some of this stuff so that I can visualize better. Another productive day in Stardew Valley, good. Good. seen the Gengar? <laughs> it's something. 
It is something. I think I'm gonna sell these fossils. I don't think most people are working on their museums still. And I'll ransack the goodies. Um, yeah, I think I'm gonna get rid of all this stuff. Like, I might keep this idea in spirit somewhere. Plus, I love the patterns we use for them. Just not as much space, you know what I mean? Because it isn't like the focus of the island anymore. But I think I'm gonna tear this whole thing down as well. I did check all of these, yeah. I still need fossils for this museum, but I did check all of these, thankfully. They're... I shouldn't say thankfully, they're unneeded, but you know what I mean. Honestly, I'm just gonna get rid of all of this right here. Of your nest, four foot twenty. <laughs> oh yeah? Look at Lucy. Just walking around town like her days aren't numbered. I totally get that lucky. I feel like I was very much like reclusive when I was young. I would just stay in my room all the time because I didn't like being in rooms where other people were. That's different with Josh. For the most part, I like being in his presence. <laughs> Just not when he's grumpy and working. Actually, I'm gonna make this one bigger so I can keep that thing there. So yeah, if my if my thought to like make a little downtown area uh is something we go forward with i think i'll do that i'll do i'll try and do like the houses more or less all together and then also um excuse me um nooks cranny and abel sisters and I, I guess the museum too i don't want them where they are right now though obviously but we'll get there vivian <laughs> she has her little pit crew shirt on She's like, I'm stuck. I can't get out. Oh my God. I could open up the left side like I did over here. Just for some reason liked the idea of it being sort of enclosed. And I want lots of water everywhere too. out with dinner then do separate things after because I love watching YouTube alone in bed. Josh has been so into learning all of his coding and, and like game dev stuff that he will spend an entire day on the computer and I'll be like I miss you <laughs> but it's kind of nice whoops because then I'll just do whatever and just have like some me time. I'll sit there and scroll TikTok and he can't judge me for it. Um don't really want any flowers to spread, so I guess I'll utilize the beaches. Gotta wrap up your lunch, Allie. Have a good rest of the day. tear down all my bridges too you can only do like one demolition a day can't you 
So my river head is here. I might keep this area. And then for now, I'll oh, get rid of everything else. All right, we're definitely going to be doing uh, <laughs> some time traveling then. myself today too too i want i want a natural path i might be really boring and go with some version of the path and then i kind of want to find like a like a street like pavement looking path maybe or the town area about getting a space heater have by your desk honestly i considered getting a space heater for this room because it's chilly down here in the winter but i have this heating pad for my back and it's been keeping me warm as well as keeping my back feeling nice <laughs> you go save high rule sammy going on do, 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 do. oopsies Friday and done with work for the week nice someone cleaning up their island the other day and they plopped a whole bunch of stuff in the cell box outside of nooks forgot that was a thing yeah <laughs> i was doing some stuff late last night and everything was closed actually i think i just threw like some bugs in it but yeah i was like oh i guess i can do that that's terrifying cam <laughs> that sounds like a hazard Got a glass of wine. Have one for me, please. Okay. So what do we end up with? Rent and load table. I mean, I'll keep this stuff because you just never know. With everything being as new as it is on this island. Uh, I'm, I may want this stuff down the line, I guess, you know? I'll have two of you, thank you. What's <laughs> wrong, Chelsea? Back up for raids in an hour and I'm still at the office. Uh-oh! How far do you uh, work from home? Is it a quick travel home? Damn, okay, let's go store this, I guess. I'm just gonna sell all these recipes too, I think, because I checked all of these recipes and I don't need them as well, so. I'll keep the stuff in the clothes though. 10 minutes at most, that's nice. That helps. If, you know, that you're not commuting far, at least. With how much you work all the time. Okay. 
Yeah. Oops. Never want to commute longer than 15 minutes. I know. It's like, I know people don't have a choice a lot of the time, but my mom used to... She would, by, by the end, before she retired, like the last five, ten years before she retired, she would work two or three days from home. But she did, She only got there because she worked at this company for like 20 plus years, you know what I mean? So when she had to go into, into work, she had to drive like 45 minutes. And I was like, uh... <laughs> God, and that's not even that bad compared to like some, I'm sure, what people have to do. It's tough though, because like a lot of times where you're working is like in the city, obviously varies, depends on where you live. But like, you know, the good jobs are in the urban area, the, the populated area. But it's cheaper to live not in that area, so it's like... Either you pay more and you commute less, or you pay less so you commute more, you know what I mean? Two hours you had to do, Tootie? Oh my god! So you were commuting, what, four hours a day when you went to work or whatever? My goodness. My uncle in Atlanta has something like a two-hour commute. That blows my mind. Like, again, I get it. It's unavoidable sometimes, but it's like, holy crap. That's so much of your day. When Josh was working at Twitch, he would... Either drive himself or I would drive him to the ferry station. That was about 10 minutes. Then he rode the ferry for like, I don't know, 20 minutes or so. Maybe 30. I don't remember how long the ferry ride was. And then he'd walk 10 more minutes from the ferry station to the office. And at the time I was like, you got it easy. Cause like, you're not driving, you know? You're just riding stuff. Like at most you drive 10 minutes, you know? But ended up being, you know, 45 minutes to an hour every day. It's a lot of time. You bought a space heater, Lucky. Good. Three hours a day, 90 minutes one way. Yeah. That I currently work remote. You know, I'm actually really curious to see how like the work dynamic changes permanently, like long term, because of COVID. Like, it's been made very clear that people can do their jobs and do the things that are expected of them without having to be in the office. <laughs> and I'm wondering if more remote jobs are going to be the norm. I mean, I can only imagine. Oh, I guess I'll keep the clothing stuff, too, because you just never know. No days aren't gonna exist because every student and teacher knows how to- Oh my god, do things remote now? I hadn't even thought about that. That's a really good point. Yeah. Grandma, what's a snow day? <laughs> oh, that's funny. That is funny. I think Josh's mom, she uh, works at an elementary school and I don't can't remember. Last I heard, some of the parents in the district were being dummies. And so, long story short, she has to go back sooner than they were, uh, like, planning to go back. Which, on one hand, I'm sure she's very excited about because, like, she works in a makerspace. And so, like, 
the whole point is that everything is hands-on and explorative and stuff but also she's like god damn it like you know what i mean uh this is gonna be a mess but Some schools are just turning snow days into e-learning days. I mean, it makes sense. Plus, as great as snow days were as a kid, then you had to push those makeup days into the summer and, and summer break started later, you know? I mean, it would depend. If you only had like two or three snow days, I we didn't have to make them up. But if we ended up getting like a week's worth off or something then we had to make it up at the end of the year wow this is wild you guys oh yeah no schooling doesn't need to be online like that's yeah, that's different. Working from home is very different than kids being in school. But I don't think that we should be rushing kids back to school until it's safe, you know? <laughs> you appreciate the snow days more now than when you were a kid. I can believe it. Teachers deserve those breaks too. Teachers need those breaks. I don't know a single teacher. Every teacher, I, I, I know a lot of teachers in my personal life and they're all doing it because they love it and it's what they're passionate about and that's what you want. But my God, teachers are getting just screwed over left and right constantly, dude. What was my mind? The bureaucracy of it all. Okay. That was a pretty big cleanup. I didn't intend to do that today, but it just made sense to, to not have crap out there, you know? The paths are still on the ground, but it's a little bit better. A little bit easier to, like, visualize, I think. The buildings being there... <laughs> I'm not trying to terraform, sorry. The buildings being there, the, the shop needs to go, but for now it's better. I don't think I'm gonna move those until I get rid of all the rivers and stuff though and figure out where I want like the town area and neighborhood to be, you know? Yeah, we had something similar, Averna. Like, our... I think senior year... Like, seniors just got out earlier in general. Because I remember Josh was in a class where he was the only junior and everybody else was a senior. And so everybody left. Like, all the seniors left. And he was literally the only person left in the class. <laughs> For, like, two weeks. It was with one of the better teachers that he had. Actually, one of our favorite teachers. But it was really funny. I always thought that was so weird. Okay, so I'm probably gonna do more with this. I don't want just like a skinny thing behind it. But right now, while those flowers are there and while I don't have quite as much direction as I would like yet, I just wanted to cl close it in so I could have this back part. Yeah, I, I like that. Feels nice. Uh, Brianna, thank you for the 11-month resub. I hope you were doing well. Really rough week. Glad to be here and hang out. I understand that. I hope you're doing all right. Hope you're having a better day today. All right. Seniors always got out two weeks early here, too, but the makeup days meant the other kids were there for a month after us. I'm sure they were thrilled. like your town flag thank you i am i i made it but it's not my design <laughs> i saw someone post that design but the code was only available as a shirt 
and I wanted it for my flag. So I recreated it based on that. I should find that code again. Okay, let's make this area bigger. My God, if you're not. Where are you? Are you in like Michigan or something? stars and shine heavy lake effect band in west michigan <laughs> vivian's killing me with her little referee shirt <laughs> it's like just so not her you know what i mean COVID since Sunday, diagnosed with pneumonia in addition. Oh my God. Are you feeling like any better right now? I can't even imagine. I, I wish you the best, Brandon. I'm sorry to hear you're dealing with that. This kind of looks like a grand piano shape. <laughs> Currently. <laughs> oh, Jenna. You have a lot. Well, you're you're West Coast, so it's it's still early for you, huh? You have a lot to do. always hear the balloons like well before me to be fair i think it's easier with like headphones and whatever i have my game audio really quiet but you're, you guys always catch my balloons before i do one of those things that gets worse before it gets better so i'm trying to stay positive surpassed 800 hours in new horizon so that's a plus well i will be keeping you i'll be thinking of you hoping recovery is speedy Oh, yes, good. More money. Um, walking around up there. Look at Lucy's creepy little silhouette way up there. Ooh, actually, I kind of like that. <laughs> Project due at the end of next week, and I'm just trying to stay on top of it. I believe in you. Damn, I really needed food. I'm so mad I didn't find a snack up there. <laughs> I'm about to run back upstairs and... <laughs> Raid the, the kitchen again in hopes of something appearing that wasn't there 20 minutes ago, half an hour ago, whatever. Oh, this is a cherry tree. Uh, that's fine. Oh, my bad.
We don't have any food. I mean, that's not true, but... I like. It's a start. I'll put some flowers up there eventually, too. We need to go grocery shopping so bad. I think I'm going to try and put in an online order tonight. For pickup tomorrow. Bro, what? You can do that? I didn't even know you could do the water thing on the level that you're not on. I kind of like that too, though. The like an asymmetrical vibe we got going on. Come on! Thank you. <laughs> okay, let's not mess it up this time. Yes? Okay. I understand. I don't understand, actually. Can't do that. Okay. Well, then I will just cover that up. <laughs> Hi there, uh, Wolvers. Hang on the background while I read you my island, though I have no idea what I want my layout to be. I don't really either. <laughs> I'm like trying to redo this island and I, oh look at that dung beetle made a big snowball dude he's so strong I feel like it's hard for me to plan ahead when it comes to animal crossing I don't know why I have to trial and error it um all right so like obviously I have tons of little detail work to do as far as decoration goes up here, but just to kind of get some ideas flowing. What if I did that? I'm okay with it. I like it. Hey, Steven, how you doing today? Okay, I kind of want to work on my entrance area. <clears throat> I want to figure out what the heck I'm doing. Because I, I like that. Oh, you're so cute. I like the direction. <clears throat> we're moving in oh my god my voice is gone <clears throat> around the plaza here so my entrance is like right here it's not quite centered but it's decently close so i want just like a walkway like this that leads in and then around it i want raised land like is already here i want water and i want trees Oh, okay. That's what we'll do. Let's go look for paths. Before I get too carried away, I need to find a path that I think I'm going to use, like, pretty long term. Oh, you did it! You did all 60 visits? <laughs> How many hours did it take you? Somebody on TikTok of a dung beetle doing the same thing, and this person got close to it and did the yelling reaction, and it flew away. Oh boy. I don't think I have a custom uh, a town tune on, on this island either. I'm gonna have to figure out what I want to do. Is something on my monitor. Okay. Okay. <laughs> I want to. I I want to look at some variations of the path. 
And I feel like the best way to do that is to just type the word path. This is a bad idea. I'm gonna wanna have to look online, I think, for these codes. Here's one. Do, 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 do. Yeah. I wonder if people do. Oh, these are all literally called path. Okay, I see. <laughs> What's that custom shirt? Uh, I don't know. I'd have to look. Um, what am I looking for? Oh my god, I can't type. Animal Crossing! <sighs> Ooh. What kind am I going for? Honestly, something probably similar to the original. Something um, that looks like dirt. Uh, but I'm okay if there's like little extra embellishments, you know? I could grab one that I like and use it for now. You know, one of those nine part patterns. Um, and then if I find something else, it'll be, I can just replace them exactly and it'll be an easy swap out. <clears throat> God, my voice today. <clears throat> All right, I might use this one just for now. It is quite nice, actually. Oh my god! Every time I stop on a number, my stick jerks to a different number. That's so annoying. No? Oh my god, I'm gonna scream. <laughs> god. Ooh, the only downside... Okay, so this is like kind of a dark one. I like it. The only downside is I love the leaves and rocks and stuff, but those would be additional spaces. You know what I mean? Also, one thing I want to do around this island is try and use a big variety of flowers because I'm very like in my other island, you know, I'm, I use so few flowers. I have flowers everywhere, but I use like specific ones. I want it to be very like colorful everywhere and I want to use different colors and different kinds of uh, flowers. Oh my God. Damn. See, like, look how good this picture looks, but you can tell that it has, like, all of the variations saved, like the leaves and the stones, but I don't... God, I don't know. I'm gonna start with the basic nine. And go from there, you know? I do like this puddle with the little paw print next to it. That's cute. All right. Okay, so we'll start with... Oh, I do have a bunch of open patterns too. Yeah, January update. I don't know if we're getting more design slots. I'm excited for Pave, though. Oh, bring me my boy. Did I pick the right one? I assume I did. Okay, I did. Left. Save the cherry blossom pattern for spring. 
Are you excited to use it? Yeah. Kind of funny. I feel like the island has to be um like redone every Ooh, center overgrown. Let's see. Okay, I will I'll do this and then like some of my centers can be overgrown too. We'll see. Let's see. Um I feel like I have to like redo my island for every season, you know? <laughs> oh, look, and there's prints. There's very, oh God. Oh, I hate it. It's so good. Makes me angry. <laughs> All right, right. <clears throat> Can you send it to me, Steven? I'd still like to see it or like, you know, put it in chat or whatever. Send it to me. You know what I mean? <laughs> I, I would still see it I would like to, I would like to see it it's like I said if we decide to redo the path it'll be easy if I just do like a nine part path you know exactly time sorcerer yep God. Okay, we'll work with that. Cinnabadger, welcome. How you doing? <laughs> there goes the pro controller. Okay. <laughs> good, just working. I hope work's good today. Oh, I love these puddles, you guys. Love doing seasons on your island, yeah. I can't tell, are those like different colored flowers as like the color pops, you know what I mean? Damn, I'm probably gonna want a little bit of the skinny paths too, so I can do skinny paths in some areas. Stumped for the rest of winter thinking about time traveling to spring. Yeah, my main island still has tons of Christmas stuff everywhere. And I was thinking about it yesterday. I was like, uh, I guess it can be Christmas until March. Because <laughs> I don't know what else to do. Wait, did I just... Good job, Renee. Big brain. So if I want the narrow pieces, that's six more. Oh, and I wanted to keep the overgrown center too. <laughs> oh boy. Um. Oh, those their little spots are cute too. Oh my god, I would literally pay money to like double my my pattern spots. Colorful flowers and tiny red mushrooms. That's cute. I like that. I'm not opposed to it. I guess it depends on if I fall in love with this. Shoot, um, I should favor that person. Hold on. I loved the Pave furniture too. I like, I hope we see a return or some, something that resembles it, you know? 
Um, okay. Oh yeah, so I also wanted to find... Um... It's like a street pattern. Like a pavement looking thing. Um, hmm. Yeah, I'm excited to see Pave as well. Damn, this is gonna take up so many more spaces if I do this, though. I might have to. <laughs> Just be okay with using regular like cobble patterns or something like the you know whatever that existing one is you know what i should do is go to the acqr reddit real quick Okay, sorry. <laughs> I got distracted by something. Okay. Um, Josh and Ashley are messaging in the group, and Josh is saying something about Donald J. Wittenkeller, and I'm trying to find the context for why he would even joke about naming our child that. Um, <laughs> but there's too many messages for me to catch up on. Wait, why is the search function not searching within this subreddit? Hello? There we go. There we go. <laughs> my ears perked. <laughs> Don't worry, guys. I would never. Also, because my father's name is Donald and there's no way on this earth I would name my child anything to do with that man. <laughs> it's better to not know. You may be right. Okay, I'm going to show some pictures. I'm going to share some pictures that I'm just looking at. I want you guys to tell me. Um, which ones we like. So here's one. This is kind of the vibe I was thinking. <sighs> Although I don't know if I want that much like white. But like something perhaps like that. Doo -doo -doo. Um, I don't like this other one as much. Hmm. A lot of them are like really dark looking and I actually, I think I like the lighter pavement look. So actually, here's something I could consider instead, although it maybe would take, well, no, it wouldn't take up as many spots. But like instead, I could use the existing paths like I was saying. Whoa, that's a big picture. Um, and then just get these transparent lines. 
and do something like that instead with it. I'm so indecisive, dudes. You're back from Hyrule. It's a bit on fire. <laughs> oh no. Started your first playthrough of Majora's Mask. That is one I have not played. If I do a second island, it'll be more urban, especially since my main is main is themed to fantasy kinda, yeah. I'm kinda I want like very woodsy stuff for the wolves, but I want all the houses and buildings and stuff to feel like they're more in like an urban setting. <laughs> My goodness. Um, let me look at that first one again. I don't know. I feel like I like this one a lot, though. Let me look at what they actually. OK, let's, let's see what their patterns look like, like how many there are. There's going to be 87 billion. But. Okay. Okay. I don't know what these are. Oh, they're like uh railroads. The looking. I think. <laughs> yeah. And this goes in the middle, I see. Um It would be 17 patterns if I took all of them. I kind of liked their like sidewalk looking ones too. Oof. Get the picture again. I'm not gonna lie, I really like it. <laughs> oh, I don't know. Let's let's uh let me favorite this creator. <coughs> like I have plenty of space to work with. It's just I don't know what I'm what I'm gonna want down the line in addition to just all my paths, you know what I mean? So like technically I could get rid of this stuff because we haven't we're probably not going to use it the same. Um, yeah, I could really get rid of all of this stuff. So let's say I did that pattern. What did I say it was like 17? I could do uh, 1, 2, 3, 5, 10, 15, 17 patterns there. Then what would I have? I mean, there still would be 20 open slots if I replaced everything else. Which sounds like a lot. I'm going to do it. I'm going to frustrate. This is a problem for future me. I don't know why this stresses me out so much. It shouldn't. <laughs> I'm like, uh. <laughs> Jimmy, hello. Maybe if there's a happy home designer themed update, they'll give us happy home designer pattern space. Yeah, right. <laughs> I'm not kidding. I would pay money. The Skies Island is named Uwu. I love it. Technically, they give us less slots per character in New Horizons and a New Leaf, even though overall we get two more spaces. You mean because each character could have their own set in New Leaf? So it ended up being like a ton more. Did I count these two? Oh, it would be 19 if I wanted these brick and concrete as well. Hmm. 
I'm gonna put them in the bottom. Yeah, the other one I was looking at here. Um, oh, <laughs> there we go. Lee. <laughs> It's the Lee one. I think <clears throat> I'm probably gonna grab a couple more of those like skinny patterns too from the other path. Isn't this really exciting content? Isn't this just so fun? In order to keep that same ratio, they need to give us 14 more slots. We have a total of 64. I'm like, I'm surprised. I mean, I don't know the reasoning. I don't make games. I don't know how things work, but I am surprised that they made it so that um, every character shares patterns. I guess the idea is like each profile on the Switch is a different person. I mean, that's kind of always been the idea in Animal Crossing, but people obviously have always used the different characters as, you know, various things. I guess it just makes more sense that like each Switch profile would actually be a different person sharing, but I don't know. <laughs> this is true, Tad. I, uh, I'm also very thankful for these people because I can't make patterns to save my life. <sighs> yeah, I, I mean, I'm, I'm okay with there being a limit. Because you're probably right, Allie. It would... it could cause issues. The problem is that everyone is just so talented. Like, all these paths and stuff take up so many spots. Spent four hours making a path pattern for myself, and it's nowhere nearly as immensely detailed as any of these, yeah. <laughs> Here, here's a pattern I made. Ready? I don't know if I'd use these very much, these single lines, but I'll grab them for now. Um, this pattern I made... <laughs> to do my frogger thing that was like oh quick i need a street i'll just make one i think i made that did i no i didn't even make that one never mind i, I had some of my own patterns i think on my other island but not anymore surely it's just not worth it it's not worth it for me to try when i can just go on the internet find this kind of stuff
God. <laughs> well, it's okay, we still honestly do have tons of space. <laughs> yeah, I won't have any good patterns for fireworks shows. That's that's true. Okay, I'm not even gonna use like any of those today because I have no idea where I'm gonna move everything around. But I am gonna use the dirt path. like lots of trees in this area I want to put the path down first but then I want to figure out <clears throat> placement of other things you know the snow looks less nice poking through those holes than the grass does. After New Year's Day, you went back to spring. I'm totally fine with the winter vibe in my other island. I feel like this island's probably gonna look better. Not in the winter. Oh, wish there were icicles on buildings. That'd be cute. Christmas was super nice, but yeah, kind of over it. I think it's just... I'm not sure what to even um, do winter-wise that isn't Christmas, you know what I mean? <laughs> That still isn't what I want. Is it? Eh, I'll worry about that side later. Oh my god, could you imagine if all the villagers' houses had little Christmas lights on them? I appreciate the decorations on the stores and stuff, you know? But, yeah, that would be awesome. Hunger, you guys. No! <laughs> God! Who does she think she is placing these paths? Oh my God. Does this look good? 
works. It works. Okay, I'm gonna make that water bigger, I think, too. Island just feels so dark at night. That would be so nice. The lights everywhere? Yeah, that would be awesome. <laughs> yeah, I gave, uh... I gave a couple snowflake wreaths out, too. I think I gave three out, and two of the three hung them up. And I think maybe I gave the ornament wreath to somebody, too. All right, I gotta make that not so straight. You know what I mean? <laughs> oh, you have the aura, the, the Northern Lights or whatever. I haven't seen that yet in game. I haven't played at night very much. Alright, this I'm totally just trial and erroring because I don't really know what I want to do. Is my work in progress, Main Island? Not Aurora, so that's fun. No! Why did you turn to the side like that, you doof? Hi, Chief. Why do they always have to be in my face <laughs> when I'm doing like terraforming stuff? Like I love you, but you're- they always like sit down right where I need to lay a path or something too. <laughs> Oh my god, I'm the worst. Why can't I walk in a straight line? Okay. It was... Ew. I just... It needs to look more, uh... I don't know. That's better. That's much better. I didn't want it to just be a straight line. But I did want it to end in two with the thing here. I might put, like, trees right here or something. I think it gives it a more natural feel, yeah, when it's not just, like, straight lines. <laughs> it's, it's a money day. This will head in this direction. I don't know what's going to be over there, so I'm not going to worry about that. I just want to get sort of more of a feel for what's going on in the entrance here. I'm going to go dig up a bunch of trees, too. I'm going to move those over here. I wonder if I have any edibles <laughs> in my storage. Pop so many balloons but haven't gotten any winter DIYs yet. I know that there's still the snowflake ones that you can get in the balloons, but yeah, they're not. Or I, I actually, 
I know you could get them yesterday. Oh, you'll love to see it. They added edibles. <laughs> oh, man. Okay. May I have to, my whole island run mostly straight past the beginning and now I hate it, but I'm not sure I have the energy to redo it all. That's how my main island is, yeah. It's kind of nice, because like, as I was playing the game for the first time, right, I didn't know everything and so it was a learning process. It was trial and error when we were like learning how to play the game and everything. And as time went on, people shared their really brilliant ideas and stuff, right? And now that I'm doing this island, sort of starting over with it, let me do something here. Um, it's nice because I have all these, like, it isn't planned out, but I have like these ideas in my head or like I've learned from my other island or I've learned by seeing people's islands. You know what I mean? It helps. And I, I normally would, like, I wouldn't tear down my other island, but the fact that we're basically going to flatten this whole island and then work it back up, I feel like, is the play. Oh, girl. She got places to be. <laughs> she was wearing this last night, too. Oh, are you going to buy some new shoes? <laughs> I love her. I didn't even dig up that tree I was next to, did I? <laughs> Look, I replaced all those number patterns and stuff. boy. That is a project for another day. feels like a I'm sitting on the couch in the evening watching TV kind of project, you know what I mean? Girl, you move fast! <laughs> Candy is horrifying. The mouse? She's my birthday twin. Fuck. <laughs> oh my god, who gave me tools? Who said it was okay for me to have tools? I feel like, um, that's not gonna look good right next to the water. Ah! It could be worse.
Sly's cool. I like Sly. I like a lot of the gators. I think they're pretty good. That's as far as I'm going in this direction because I have no idea what is going to be on the right side. Why? Literally. Why? <laughs> okay. Oh my god, it's five o'clock. Candy? This is some BS. Hey there, bug. A villager has a birthday on October 25th. Oh, that's right. I remember that now. That's Josh's birthday. I was just trying to remember who his birthday twin is. Girl. Anacati is yours. Al is yours, Time Sorcerer. <laughs> but also Red. That's cool. Yeah, there's no uh, like special NPCs around my birthday. Benedict. <laughs> I guess with how, how many villagers there are, ugh, some of us are bound to have not our favorites. Bum, bum, bum. have like cabiny looking houses. I think Fangs is like sort of close. You know, he, his is like white with the wood whatever's. Okay, twin is Biff. may change over time but you know we're trying 
I have to get all- I'm gonna get like flowers and bushes and god knows what all up here. A, a branch already fell off this tree? I just planted that. <laughs> Oh, good night, Cam. I hope that the rebuilding process is swift. I don't know. I'm heartbroken for you. <laughs> Thanks for hanging out today. Have a good one. God, I'm so annoyed at myself. I can do anything right. Rosewood, yeah. We we tore this sucker down. I do want to get rid of all the rivers and stuff too, but I'll probably do that on my own. I've been foc focusing on this entrance area. You can kind of see the terraforming we've started. Um, ooh, that line. Ugh. This will surely branch off into a path in that direction somehow, maybe right here. Get some water up here, too. Hmm. I mean, I guess we just do it, right? And if we don't like it, we take it down. totally redo the wolves houses though <laughs> so I can like change the style a little bit and do different paths and stuff it's gonna be tedious though obviously because if I want everyone if I want them to still be in that corner I have to move them once and then once again back so I don't know definitely I'm gonna want to plan out what I'm doing I think with the houses before I do it. Whatever it may end up being. Yeah, it probably would make more sense to put them elsewhere. You know, they could be to the right here, like through this area. This could lead into our city area, this whole thing is open. I mean, I don't know. I wanna put my lighthouse here. I wanna raise the land here and put my lighthouse on it. Like there's definitely decent space here. It just kind of depends, I guess, on what we end up doing with it. Oh, and it also, like there's two, two like there's this entrance into the right side of the plaza too. So like this could lead to the little city area too. Oh, you're trying to get some blue roses. Yeah, it can be an adventure. <laughs> Fang's got his little sandwich. Can I have a bite? I'm hungry. I'm hungry. <laughs>
This edge feels weird. Whoops! Gotten purple and orange. I feel like I'm on the right path. Just need those hybrid reds. Yeah. I feel like the blue roses have to be the hardest ones to get, right? than green mums I think yeah I don't think I actually bred for my green mums <laughs> long term Back when I was making it like Rainbow Flower Garden, a lot of people gave me some hybrids that I think I ended up cloning, which was very helpful. I was like, ooh, all this new stuff. She's digging it. She likes what she sees. Eventually all of these raised areas I'm doing will have like tons of little clutter items on them, but I'm just trying to get like bases down, you know? Wow, I haven't blinked in like a minute because I just did and my eyes are burning. <laughs> Terraforming is serious business, man. Oh, I'm crying. I guess I ought to put some some sort of left heading path here so I kind of know where I want my trees to be. p.m. and only just cooking dinner. Hey, we've all had those days. Josh and I didn't eat until like 9.30 last night. I had to set an alarm for like 11.30 to test my blood sugar because I was like, I'm gonna fall asleep <laughs> before I do that. But I actually was awake. I was playing Animal Crossing. I had a moment. I was like, what am I doing? liking what we have going on here. I think I'm gonna have to just do like sections like this the whole time. 
on this island, otherwise I'm just gonna be like, lost. There's a bench like right there, but what if I put this garden bench here? Who's gonna stop me? Hm? Are you gonna stop me, chat? Didn't think so. stool? I guess not. Okay. No biggie. No biggie. Okay, I actually want to switch this Freya, am I in your way? <laughs> Do pardon me. <laughs> like where she plopped. in my hand. I was like, what's happening? Uh. Soft serve lamb. Alright, I'm like, I'm feeling this start so far. Like, I feel like we actually have done some good stuff today. Feels like a solid base. I, you know, how big are the houses? Four by four by four, I think. I think the houses are four by three, but you have to do four by four because there's sort of like an invisible one, like strip in front of them, right? What if I figured out, what if I started plotting out houses over here and also, um, what do you call it? Cranny and shit. Oh, you know what I want to do? I ordered that lighthouse. I'll come tomorrow. I want to be basic and put my lighthouse on a raised thing out here. <laughs> I got it, Tabby. Thank you. Okay, yeah. Four by four on houses. The shop is big. I'm gonna save this. Yeah, I'm gonna figure out where I want to put that stuff. Oh yeah, I have tons of hybrids that I, I dropped off from my other island because I was trying to get rid of them. So we have a bit of a mess of flowers that I'm gonna have to... <laughs> this big snowball cracks me up for some reason. Big mess of flowers we're gonna have to sort through. I, I do want to try and keep some though because like I said I want to try and use like a variety of colors and types of flowers on this island because I normally don't do that and I think it would be nice. Okay that's probably as far as I can go right? Oh oh you love to see it. Can I do this? Oh okay.
There's no way for me to round that, is there? That's what I was afraid of. No biggie. Um, we can have. Well, we'll see. I guess I'll fiddle with it more tomorrow too when I actually have the lighthouse, you know. But my peninsula is kind of big at the end here so we do have a little bit of space to do some stuff yeah i could put my lighthouse in that corner i suppose too i'll play around with everything I don't like that little, <laughs> that one little edge over there. Jealous of the people who have a peninsula big enough for a villager's house. Do I? Because I... What did we say it was? Four by four? Because how cute would it be to have a little villager's house as like the lighthouse keeper? I'd have to do the lighthouse like on this side of the house though. I know we just put this up. Because my whole, um, like neighborhood area is going to be on this side of the island probably long term. So it wouldn't be super out of place. I'm just kind of curious what it would look like. I don't, it might, it might, it probably could fit, but it probably is cramped. Let me see how big four by four is. Because I would, no, because I would need to like, um, I want something with like visible. There's probably no way it could be right here, right? Nah, we'll just stick the lighthouse over here. like a space case just I can't I can't focus on I'm just doing little stuff here and there she put her her referee shirt back on okay um I might actually call it a day for stream here no it's been short I'm sorry uh the only reason is I gotta make sure I make dinner before um seven it's only 5 20 but some cleaning is going to be needed before I can start cooking. Although I did run a load of dishes today. You'll be proud of me. Oh yeah, I never finished this water area, did I? Honestly though, I feel really good about what we've done so far. I'm excited to... Keep working here. It'll be really fun putting all of our like little detail decorations in for sure. And moving all those flowers and stuff too. I'm excited. I feel good. I feel good. Uh, off stream, I'll work on 
flattening more of the island and like getting rid of my rivers and stuff so that I can focus on this kind of stuff again the next time we we hang out. Um, I'll try and start planning out where I want all the buildings and stuff too. Definitely gonna have to demolish, I think, at least two of my bridges, if not all three. Had a bunch of mush things. You know, yeah, I probably could give myself a bunch of that stuff that I'm not using right now seasonally. That's taking up storage in my main island, but I would happily raid all of your stuff as well, Sammy. <laughs> I would happily do it. All right, friends. Ah. Feeling good. I definitely want to get some big water areas. Uh, eventually. I don't know where yet. And have, like, really nice, um, picture picture zones. I want to have, like, diagonal bridges because I haven't done that. And I feel like that looks nice. All this kind of stuff. I don't know. I'm excited. I'm excited. Um, here's the deal, friends. I am going to be trying to do four days a week instead of five for, the, like, the foreseeable future because, uh, <laughs> life has been catching up with me very quickly. Um, and, you know, just busy doctor stuff. I'm, I'm trying to take advantage of the feeling good right now before I get too pregnant and I don't feel good again. <laughs> so I'm trying to get stuff done around the house. I have doctor's appointments a lot. So that being said, I might not see you guys for a few days. Please don't forget about me. Um, we might do Tuesday through Friday as our days, but that does mean three days in a row of no stream, which I know can be kind of detrimental for streams and whatever, but just just so you guys know, that's kind of where my mind is at right now. Also, Fias, thank you so very much for the 18 month resub. But, you know, we'll figure it out. We'll figure it out. Uh, at, at the very least, it's going to be good. Um, good practice for when I inevitably disappear <laughs> for God knows how long because I can promise you I will not be streaming for like a very long time after I have the baby so <laughs> we're gonna start weaning ourselves off of streams for a little bit don't worry it won't be forever it won't be forever but you know you guys get it you know how it be you know how it be <clears throat> But yeah, just so you know, I might not see you guys again until Tuesday. So, I'll let you guys know if that changes, obviously. Um, let's go hang out with... Let's go hang out with Ellie. She's playing Puyo Puyo Tetris. Change. Oops, there we go. Uh, thank you guys for hanging out with me, though, and uh, if anything exciting happens in the development of Rosewood over the next three days, I will share it with you guys, because I'm very much, that's all my mind thinks about when it comes to video games is, ooh, let's do some, some terraforming, some decorating. So, make sure you join the raid, go give Allie some love in her chat, take care of yourselves, have a, a wonderful weekend, maybe down the line we can, like, switch up days and I can throw, I can instead do like wednesday through saturday or something so i can hang out with you guys on, on a weekend day i don't know we'll figure it out we'll figure it out but anyway thanks for being here thanks for being the best uh i will see you guys next time whenever that is probably tuesday <laughs> have a wonderful weekend take care of yourselves i will see you next time stay awesome